Hello and welcome to Reading with an Intervention Specialist. My name is Christina and today we are going to read A Normal Pig by Kay Steele. I really like this uh, class picture going on here. Just want to let you know. And the uh, bunny ears that are going on. And the teacher that's watching the bunny ears. <laughs> okay. was a normal pig who did normal stuff, right? So we're gonna find Pip on this page. Pip is this person right here, or this pig. She has spots, okay? And looks like she's playing on this playground with her friends, right, and her classmates, and one's going down the slide here, and the other ones are jumping rope on this page. They all look quite content, don't they? Pip likes making art, cooking with her family, and thinking about what she wanted to be when she grew up. So let's look. What kind of things did she want to do when she grew up? Looks like she wanted to be a cameraman for the TV, maybe a reporter, a journalist or a writer, a fortune teller, Looks like a brain surgeon or something. I don't know. It looks like a brain. An astronaut looking at some type of material. Maybe a farmer or a, um, somebody that fixes things, right? This is like, just like she's looking in class right now. Okay. Then one day, a new pig came to school. A new pig. Ew, what are you eating? It stinks. Pip didn't know how to respond. It was just her normal lunch. Doesn't look bad to me. The new pig was also on Pip's art class too. Weren't we supposed to draw houses? Hmm. Let's see here. Uh, looks like there's a house there. House, 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 house. I kind of see a house. I mean, and then there's a house there. Maybe she went for the barn, who knows. See all this, by the way, I want to show you this guy. He's really messy. And I really like this one because he's cleaning. Here's a picture. Band practice. All right. Pip hadn't changed, but she had started to feel different. Is that your babysitter over there? That's my mom. Oh. See your mom? The little baby brother or sister? <laughs> There's Pip on the bus. Everybody's talking to the new kid, trying to get to know him. Not talking to Pip. Pip gets home, very upset, trying to draw a house. When her parents asked her what was wrong, she replied, Why can't you make me a normal lunch? Hmm. Interesting. After thinking it over, her parents decided. On Saturday, Pip's mother had an idea. Why don't we take a trip to the city as a family? Hmm. Well, Pip had never been there before. Look at the city. They're going to the city. They're going in 
They go down into the subway. The subway means it's under the streets, right? Looks like they get tickets and they get through the um, counters and then they go down and then they get into the train, right? With other people. Pip heard so many different languages. Look at all these languages that she's hearing going on around her. So many different languages. And these people, I think they're watching like something going on, like a dance or something. And they said, I don't get it. <laughs> and here's Pip with her family, her mom and her dad and her baby sister or brother. At the playground in the city, right? All the pigs looked very different. Look at how different they all look. Some have spots and some have like um, dimples and some have straight vertical lines. Some have different colored spots, right? Looks like here's the food truck. Even the food was different. Is there anything on the menu that is not weird? Ugh, Pippa. This person says, maybe it's weird for you, but not for me. I like it. Pippa thought. Hmm. And guess what? It looks like he's sharing it to let her try it. That was nice. When they got home, Pip was feeling better. Her dad asked, do you want me to make you a normal sandwich? Pip, no thanks, I'll bring what I always eat. Mom seems to be satisfied with that answer. I also like how Pip is working with her younger sibling. I don't know what they're creating there. On Monday, Pip sat at her usual table in the cafeteria with all her friends, right? Here comes the newbie. Ooh, she's back with her weird lunch again. Hmm. Wonder what, what she feels like now. Pip. Maybe it's weird for you, but not for me. I like my lunch. Want to try it? Well, all of her friends like to try it, but the new one didn't. And they thought, it's good. You want to trade lunches? Mmm, you should try it as they're trying to get the new pig to try it. Kind of backfired in his face, didn't it? So she learned something. And weirdly enough, by recess, Pip felt pretty normal again. Later. Upside down. Look this big. Trying to go up the slide. <laughs> Look at these guys. They're jumping ropes. They're all um, confused. Right? Poor little pig just hanging there. The end. Thank you for reading with me today. It was nice to have you, and I hope you continue to read. If you'd like more, subscribe to the channel, and I'll be adding here and there as I go. Have a great day.